A new study just came out that showed that Megalodon was likely larger than we ever thought before. Previously thought to be in the realm of 60 to maybe even 70 feet long, this new study showed that they could possibly be up to 80 feet long. Researchers actually had parts of a vertebral column from a megalodon, and that's really rare because this is a cartilaginous fish, and cartilage does not fossilize as well as bones do. But they really only had the vertebra, so they actually had to sort of estimate uh, what the size of the tail and the size of the head would be based on what we know about lots of other different types of sharks. And after that estimate came back at about 80 feet long, um, they also concluded that Megalodon likely looked a little bit more like a lemon shark, which is what's up here, than really anything else. And that's because there are rules when it comes to how animals are shaped and sized uh, and hydrodynamics. There's a reason that the bulky great white shark cannot grow likely to over 23 feet. Inevitably, somebody's going to get in my comments and be like, my uncle saw one that was 35 feet long. No, he didn't. In fact, the largest verified great white shark was not more than 20 feet long. Uh, now, those are all from dead specimens. No one really knows how big um, deep blue is. But yeah, because of physics, they really can't be more than 23 feet long. So yeah, you're looking at the new version of Megalodon. <laughs>